Welcome to Bike Reviews. Today we bring you an exciting update, not from the world of two wheels, but from the world of high-speed fighter jets and advanced defense technology. This is a major development in global military cooperation, Norway has officially delivered 14 F-16 Fighting Falcon fighter jets to the Royal U.S. Air Force, along with the highly advanced Saab 340 Airborne Surveillance System. Let's dive deep into what this means for international defense and air power dynamics. The F-16 Fighting Falcon is one of the most iconic multirole fighter aircraft in the world. Developed by General Dynamics and now produced by Lockheed Martin, it has been in service since the 1970s and has been adopted by air forces in over 25 countries. Known for its agility, reliability, and combat versatility, the F-16 continues to be a valuable asset even in today's era of fifth-generation fighters. Norway, a longtime user of the F-16, began phasing out the aircraft in favor of the newer F-35A Lightning II. With the F-35 now fully integrated into their air force, the Norwegian government decided to repurpose their outgoing F-16 fleet. Fourteen of these jets have now been officially handed over to the United States. But why would the US want older F-16s, you may ask? These jets are not intended for frontline combat. Instead, the US is likely to use them for training, testing, and as adversary aircraft in combat simulations. The F-16s are well suited for these roles, providing realistic dogfighting and tactical training experiences for new pilots, especially those preparing to fly advanced fighters like the F-22 and F-35. Now let's talk about the second part of this delivery, the Saab 340 Airborne Surveillance System. This Swedish-built aircraft may look like a commercial turboprop, but it has been modified into an airborne early warning and control AEW and seat system. Equipped with advanced radar and surveillance equipment, the Saab 340 can track aircraft, ships, and ground targets over vast areas. Adding this system to the U.S. Air Force's arsenal significantly enhances their situational awareness. The Saab 340 serves as the eyes in the sky, coordinating air operations, detecting threats early, and improving overall command and control capabilities. In a combat scenario, having real-time intelligence from a platform like this can be a decisive advantage. This move also represents the deepening of defense cooperation between the United States and Norway. As fellow NATO allies, both countries are aligned in their strategic defense priorities. Sharing military resources and platforms like the F-16 and Saab 340 demonstrates mutual trust and interoperability. Norway's Air Force has taken great care in maintaining their F-16s. Before the transfer, the jets underwent inspections and necessary upgrades to ensure that they meet operational standards. U.S. technicians and air crews have already begun familiarizing themselves with these jets and the surveillance aircraft, indicating how quickly they plan to put these systems into action. In terms of geopolitics, this transfer sends a powerful message. At a time when global tensions are rising and the need for readiness is greater than ever, the U.S. is strengthening its capabilities not just through innovation but through smart partnerships. Norway, with its long Arctic borders and close proximity to Russia, remains a key strategic player in the region. Their decision to contribute operational assets like these reinforces NATO's collective security posture. But what does the future hold for the F-16s? While they may be older compared to stealth fighters, their versatility makes them highly effective for secondary roles. They can be used in training missions, act as support in allied exercises, or even deployed for surveillance and patrol tasks in less contested airspace. With the U.S. maintaining and modernizing its fleet continuously, these jets could remain active for many more years in a variety of roles. As for the Saab 340, it will likely be used to support training operations and regional surveillance. While the U.S. has more advanced AWACS aircraft like the E-3 Sentry and the E-7 Wedgetail incoming, the Saab 340 offers a more compact, cost-effective solution for routine missions and regional monitoring. So to summarize, the delivery of 14 F-16 Fighting Falcons and the Saab 340 Airborne Surveillance System from Norway to the United States marks a significant development in defense collaboration. It boosts U.S. readiness, provides valuable training and support assets, and deepens the military bond between two key NATO allies. Thanks for tuning into Bike Reviews, where we don't just ride the streets, we also fly through the latest defense and technology updates. If you enjoyed this detailed breakdown, don't forget to like, 
comment, and subscribe for more insightful content. Stay safe and see you in the next video.